Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Matthias D, and I welcome you back to another episode of Legit Gaming. Tonight, what we're going to look at is a game mode that Legit Chucky and I have been playing quite a lot lately. It's Ricochet and Halo 4. We've been playing quite a few games, and you know what? It's been extremely exciting. So while we're talking about this, let's get to those highlights. All right, you guys, we're going to jump right into the first game here. We're playing five games on the map Haven. And right here, we're going to see the first game. Really, nothing to be proud about. This is just our real first full game on Ricochet. As you can see here, Legit Chuck is going to be able to find the ball carrier, take it down. And he's going to run this one in all the way, pretty much untouched and really unguarded by any of his teammates for the 50-point score. This game was pretty sad, honestly. It was really a slaughter. There's very few highlights for this one. With that, we're going to move into game two. All right, now, pretty early in the second game, Matthias D is going to get the ball, and he's just going to walk this one in for an easy 50-point score. Now we're going to move on to what is called the bonehead play of the week. Matthias D, as you can clearly see, gets a no-scope headshot to defend his teammate, who is the ball carrier. But the teammate, for some reason, believes that you can score on your own goal. You cannot score on your own goal, sir. So that is a failed attempt, and you know what, sir? You should just be ashamed. You're going to go sit in the corner for the rest of the week. Now we're back with Matthias D. He's going to get the ball, and he's going to recover it. He's going to try and score, and he's so close, but unfortunately he fails. But the play is not over just yet. As you can see, legit Chucky is able to kill those two guys in a miraculous attempt and run that ball in for a 50-point score. And now, basically to end this slaughter, Matthias D. is going to get the sword, which is only going to spell really a bad time for the other team. This is a really dangerous guy when he gets the sword in his hands, and he's going to take out not one, not two, but three members of the red team on his way to help assisting in the final score. Now we're going to move on to Game 3. Now moving on to Game 3, we're going to see some really bizarre stuff. As you can see here, Matthias D is able to kill someone with the Energy Sword, but he's going to intercept the ball and kill another guy with the ball as well. But the red team is unable to do anything with that score as Matthias D is taken down. Next possession, Matthias D gets the ball. He's going to run. He's going to try and toss it, but the ball is intercepted. But the play's not over again. Legit Chucky comes in, and he's going to save the day again. He's going to be able to kill a guy with a Needler, and he's going to run it in for another 50 points. Now, a little bit of a more bizarre play, Matthias D kills two individuals who are trying to get the energy sword, but unfortunately he's unable to take out the third and he loses his life there. But Legit Chucky, with the help of a lot of great blocks by the red team, he's going to be able to walk it in just for the final score, and the red team is going to take game three. Moving on to game four now. Absolutely nothing going right in the red team for this one. There's really no highlights needed, to be ne that needed necessary to be shown. We're just going to show Matthias T just go on a rampage right to end the game. And now we're going to move on to the final one, game five. Alright, so Game 5 is going to start off with another one of these really bizarre plays. As the ball carrier, Matthias D is going to try and run into the goal, but he's met by a member of the blue team, and inevitably, both of them take each other down. But now we're going to move on to the play of the week, and it features Matthias D. This is a really odd play again. Uh, just sitting by the enemy goal, the ball is chucked towards him, and he's able to walk it in a whole two steps for the score. Just such a weird play. The blue team was pissed. He was really excited. But... This gameplay is going to be coming up to an end here. You guys are going to see uh, Legit Chucky score the final goal to win Game 5. So thanks a lot for watching, you guys. I'm Matthias D, and I shall see you all later.